hey you guys how is everybody doing welcome back to a new vlog you see the way i'm smiling this means that i have totally missed you guys um i had taken a break for i think two weeks and honestly i don't even have a valid reason as to why i was not vlogging i just felt like i was mentally like not okay and vlogging was not giving me as much joy so i thought let me pause on it and then i'll be back once i'm feeling all better i was not sick there was literally nothing i don't even have a valid reason honestly but we are back i'm feeling so much better i have missed you i feel like i'm having fun while i'm doing this so i guess those breaks are very much needed there is one of you guys who like checked up on me and was like yeah yeah, yeah i'm just taking a break i'm totally okay so i'm always grateful for you guys when you like check up on me so today's vlog um we're getting new curtains finally i know what you're thinking stacy you already have curtains yes but um i think i had already shown you that i wanted to add some sheer curtains on this other big window i already have uh, a sheer curtain but it's not to my liking like i don't like it there is a vlogger that i was watching recently and she said <laughs> but they were so happy because i related to what she said so much she was like you know what i, I would actually go hungry when i have money so that I can save and buy something uh, for my house. Like she was just saying that to her, uh, making her space uh, as cozy, as nice as possible he is always her number one priority. And I was like, no, I feel like, I feel like that is me because every time I get some extra money, I'm like, oh, what do we need to improve? Um, Kwanyumba. So yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm one of those people, guys. I'm obsessed with like making my space ikai poa, ikai as cozy as possible. And yeah, we definitely do have a long journey to go. Don't get me wrong, but baby steps. So uh, yeah. That's the agenda for today. I feel like this will, will be like a weekly vlog because I have a lot of things to do. Tomorrow I might go to Gikomba. A client has sent me. So if I will be able to go by the by the way, reject finance bill. Reject, reject, reject. I don't know why I had forgotten that. Oh my god. So yeah, today is on Monday and Kwasaba. I'm taking advantage because people are not uh protesting today. I think so hopefully shops are opened today um, and I don't even know how I'm going to go to Gikomba by the way if that is going to happen to tomorrow I think I'll just put it on pause but we'll see so yeah that's the agenda for today curtains and then I also need oh my god I'm so sorry guys yeah <laughs> yeah I apologize yeah <laughs> also we need to wow that happens every time i'm vlogging by the way and it was all quiet until i picked up the camera but anyway i was saying i might uh buy decor books as well oh let me check i'm gonna I might add uh, a few decor books, maybe one or two. Also, good news, we are getting our dining table, but not on this vlog. The next vlog, it was actually ready, but there are a few that adjustments that I wanted the guy to make. Like, a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little the dining table is perfect you guys i cannot wait for you to see it i am so excited for it to get here but it will not be on this vlog this vlog name errand errand sheer curtains and then uh, coffee books gikomba all that stuff so yeah i hope you enjoy watching please like the video subscribe if you haven't and yeah let's head out before we head out let me show you my outfit there we go um so yeah this is my outfit of the day oh my god my house looks so empty by the way this is the space that i will place the dining table and then i also changed the i think i've already shown you i'm the queen of blabbering by the way this is my outfit flat uh, blazer because it's a bit chilly outside black and black this is a black bodysuit black tights and then some white converse shoes 
And then I have a close body bag because errands and we need to keep our things safe. So yeah, that's my outfit. Let's go. All right, you guys. So I've arrived at the decor shop and I found that they have like this cute bubble candles they actually sent us they're going for 300 i've actually always been looking for this type of candles so i'm thinking of getting one but they don't have a white one they also have storage um containers is it how much is yeah, it 350 350 more yeah. yeah and then also these soap dispensers that are looking so cute yeah the books I don't think the one that I got is going to be fungwa ivi, but we'll see when you see fungwa zinaka. So yeah, they have. I'm going to share a few other things that they have. I've also seen this calendar. In how much? Thirteen hundred. Thirteen hundred. So cute. Yeah, and this. Oh yeah, the candles. Is it ni? Is it three set? Oh, twenty-two. Oh, oh na kengine kadogo eh 2200 and then this wow eh in how much ki plus mm. 350 350 wow guys yeah so these two glasses are 350 wow these things are so cute guys i'm going to plug you the shop in case you need something nini nyingine uko nayo tunaweza oh they also have this and the glasses. Oh, this one is cute. Any? Oh, 400. So. Oh. Wow. Cute, 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 cute thing. So these are the one. This big one is 580. So this one be 300, 300, 400. And the scented candles are 300. Na honey. Yeah. Oh, wow. Any much? 850. So the honey one is 850. Guys, that's such a good price. I don't even confused, by the way. Is this soap dispensers? How much? It's in business. 1200. Both of them? Oh, wow. 1200. Both of them. Oh, yeah. There's also this. How much? 800. 800. Damn. That's a good price. And these are containers. Is those are white and black? Yeah. The basket. Uh -huh. 400. One or oh, 400 each. They have different colors, black, black and white. So yeah, they have some good, good things and the prices are quite good. And then Zilani... Oh, perfumes. Wow. Oh, guys, is it your much? Like a bunch of Yeah. So 650. Pay any 650. Yeah, 650. Oh, I'm going to But is it me? Is it me? Pay. Come on, Oh, oh. They also have this. Is it how much? 700. 700. Yeah, yeah, muffs. How much is it? Yeah, yeah, muffs. Oh, here are more holders. Oh, wow. How much is that? 300. 300. And then you may this soap. Um, soap. What is it called? Yeah, that one. How much is this? The black one. The black one. A uh, okay. thousand bob. And then some also water bottles. Very cute. I'm spoiled for choice, guys. I don't even know what I'm going to get. Yeah, that's me. But wow, you know what? I've actually always wanted some pampas grass. Not me coming for the core books and then you know pampas grass. This is so cool. Okay, let me decide what I'm getting. Then I'll I've also seen like more glasses. This is 550. See 550. Same as this ripped glass. 480. Wow. Guys, let me decide what I'm getting. Tawanyesha. A very very cute thing. You know what? Yeah. I've actually always wanted to own such a calendar. I usually think they are very aesthetic and cute. Eh, my lord. <laughs> I think I should have just gone to Isili before I came here because I had literally just come for the decor books. Now I am spoiled for choice. Spoiled, spoiled for choice. 
But they really do have nice things, honestly. They do. Oh, they also have those containers that usually have uh, bamboo leaves. Cindy, like, oh yeah, spaghetti jars. How much are they? Spaghetti jars, depends. How much? 900. 900. Oh, wow. All jar, 1100. And guys, whether these are just displays. So if you get something, and I could totally like brand new. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yeah. Wow, cute. Guys, they also have uh, perfume dupes. And yeah, I've told him to like show me a few. How much are these? 3500. 3500, eh? Na ukona bakarat. Guys, I'm always using. On the eight. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. How much is this? 3K. Yeah. Guys, I'm always plugging you this um cologne. Bede na nukianga vizuri. Ahi na nukianga vizuri. Ini, umesema 30? 3. 3300. These are like dupes for the originals. Ooh, Coco Chanel. Wow. Guys, so these are a few and they have more. They have like a variety. I didn't want a Libre, do you see? Sindo, which other one do I know? Giorgio Armani, Versace. I know I'm butchering those names, but yeah. <laughs> Guys, Musienda Kamukunji Tena, by the way, here's the plug. I'm going to leave his her number actually. It's a lady who directed me here, and then you'll find this lovely gentleman who is selling and is very friendly. So, you know, we are always down for that. So, yeah. So, I'm kind of turning in between the Tom Ford and the Christian Dior. Because, like, Akisha Zifunga Zita Five. So, I do have Tom Ford, by the way, but yeah, this one is good. This one looks nice. Guys, I really want to get these bubble uh, candles, but they don't have the color that I want. Now I'm thinking, should I get it? I might just leave it. You know, I'm one person who is always advocating for if something doesn't match your house, even if it's nice, don't get it. But here I am because I'm like, when else will I ever find bubble candles? Hmm. Let me think about it. Wine glass, 850. Guys, these verses are going for 2200. 2200. Wow. Very cute. Only been a few hours, but it felt like days. Only been days, but it felt like months. Only gone for a year, only go like once. Life moves fast when you do what you want. I guess I'm doing what I want. Look like Tyler Perry But she don't love me She's too scary My hope is fun like Jackie Brown I wanna know what she's down Will you be my leading lady? I wanna contract that no lady In the meantime It's the meantime Early the next morning. This is my breakfast this morning. Um, yeah, pretty much non explanatory <laughs> bread, eggs, and then some tea. I wanted to have some sausages, but the local shop that we usually go to, they are closed today. 
I have a client meeting in the afternoon, but once I'm done um, having my breakfast, I want to do a haul of the things that I got yesterday. Oh my god, you guys, I cannot wait for you guys to see what I got because I feel like I got like everything that I got was really, really nice, like super aesthetic. Yeah, let me take my breakfast and then we'll catch up. Um, Nikifanya haul. The first thing that I got is a decor book and it looks like this absolutely gorgeous it has billy on the cover um i don't know which is this a brand i think i feel like this is like a magazine i don't think it's a brand i've never heard of this brand before um if you know what this is you can comment down below uh but it looks like this absolutely gorgeous the name on the side coming through i love it initially i wanted a tom ford book but i already have one so i feel like if i get another one it will look i don't know it will not give a good look so I wanted something different and this is what I got. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Yeah. Now these are the items. Honestly, I did not plan to buy them, but I was like, yay, you know, I'm still going to get to get it. So I got a bubble cup. Is it a bubble cup really? I don't know what they're called. Uh but yeah, this is how it, it was wrapped. Am I the only one who like presses these things? Oh, I cannot wait. Yeah. So, this is the cup that I got. Honestly, I don't know what I'm going to place here. Or I'm even thinking I should maybe use it as a decor item. But no. I feel like this is too aesthetic. Uh, it's so cute. But the material is not heavy. So I'm assuming you cannot place hot things. So maybe like iced tea. Do I even make iced tea? I don't. Do I make smoothies? I don't. But did I get this cup? absolutely i did i don't know what use i'm going to do to, i don't know what i'm going to do with it but it is what it is guys <laughs> and then i also got this super aesthetic honestly yeah this is just for creating content honestly because i don't feel like this is functional but it's cute so we got it yeah So the other thing that I got are some pampas grass. I've only wanted this type of pampas grass by the way, so even this one I had not intended to buy, but like it was not on my budget. But I was like, oh yeah, I'm getting some pampas grass because why not? Very fluffy. I absolutely, you know, when I got home is when I realized that they were actually not the same. I feel like this one is different than this one. And this one is the one that I like. If I get another one, I'm going to add more. But this is one. These ones were super expensive. The branch was going for six hundred and fifty. So I got two. So yeah, and they're super long. They're super super long, as you can see. Uh, so yeah, I just need to get a vase, maybe a clear vase, or maybe I don't know what I'm going to get, and then I place it near my uh, mirror. Yeah. We're going to decorate with you, although I don't have a vase, so maybe not this one. So yeah. So in town, I also got this dress that looks like this. I'm not going to put it on, guys, because I'm honestly not in the mood. <laughs> this is the laziest haul that I've ever done. It looks like this. It has some crisscross at the back. It's quite flowy. It's short. And uh, yeah, super cute. This one was going for 100 bucks, so such a steal. And then now, th that's everything that I got in town. And then I also went to Isili, I think to Liena Nanini. I got some sheer curtains. So let me actually give you a short story of these sheer curtains. So initially when I, when I went to Isili, I saw uh, on Francis Kashali on her channel, she had, when she was doing her house tour, she kind of mentioned that she got her shares from Isili and she gave the number and then she said like Amita, those share cuttings, Amita was going for 100 bob. So I was like, bet, that is quite affordable and I'm going to get mine. So that's the budget that I had because I wanted like 10 meters. So for 100, that's like a thousand bob. Guys, tell me why Nilian Oko Nakuna shares 100 bob. I even called Abdi and he was nowhere to be found he actually told me that he has been called by several people who have been asking for cuttings and he actually doesn't sell cuttings so i'm assuming francisca maybe i'll go say a number so yeah 
tulitembea huko by the way tukitafuta shares za 100 ama even 150 zikakosa so i got these ones amita was going for 230 honestly i feel like that is expensive ama maybe they hiked the prices because maybe shares are are like kind of popular now i don't know honestly but that was super expensive so i'm not even going to plug you because i do feel like you can get a better deal if you kind of look more so i got that super cute absolutely love them. The other thing that I got are some cutting rods and I got the super 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 long ones. This ones are going for 1560. Again with the cutting rods, I do feel like I could have gotten a better deal, but at that point I was just bored. Sikwa na mudia kubagets of like whatever. I just need the cutting rods. They are gold in color and I'm also going to switch those ones pale yuma. I think you can see them. So yeah, I want to switch those ones and have a do. Of course, we're going. I'm going to show you. So Nishita Fundi, and I'm waiting on him. In the meantime, I will be having my lunch. Um. So I recently received a PR packet from Sela Essence. Oh my God, I am so grateful because I just I just enjoy working with brands honestly. So this product was said to be like two weeks ago. I've been just testing it out. I've worked with Sela Essence before on my previous channel. So if you're an oldie, I think you remember them. Uh, and I'm just grateful that they come back every time I work with them. So they sent me different products than the ones they sent me last time. So I wanted to test them out before I come on here and uh, plug you. So yeah, let me show you the things that they sent me. And yeah, so like I've said, Cella Essence is a skincare brand. They deal with like skincare, anything to do with skincare, they're your plug. So yeah. Guys, my phone was out of storage. I was really wondering like how that is possible. Kumbe, I had like a lot of things I've just deleted so that we can get <laughs> enough space. So yeah, as I was saying, the first thing that they sent is this skin therapy oil. As you can see, it's almost done. Oh, it's quite moisturizing. Um, the only thing that I don't like is the smell. Yeah, it doesn't have the best smell, but it's super, super moisturizing. Love, love the packaging. And yeah, that's the first thing that they sent. Um, the other thing that I absolutely love is this Ep Epsom bath salt. Um, it has lavender. Oh my god, this thing smells so good. Uh, as you can see, again, I didn't come in Asia. Guys, one thing about me, I will use something, especially if I like it. So it's like, uh, it has bicarbonate essential oil, it has citric, it has salt, sea salt, obviously, Epsom salt so many benefits and then um yeah so it's used to relieve your muscles and it moisturizes your body super super amazing and it smells nice <laughs> so yeah um the other thing that they sent is a um, healing clay mask i've not used this i've used their black mask before it was really really good so i can't wait to start using this and then the other thing that I have totally, totally used is this. It's like a face cream, absolutely moisturizing. Now this one smells super amazing. And I absolutely love the packaging. This is how it looks like. And then let's get into it. It's so bougie, I love it. So you just press like this and then the cream comes out. Oh, I don't think you can see, but yeah, absolutely love the packaging. This is what I was most excited about and honestly it's quite moisturizing so yeah this is something i've also used guys everything that i'm showing you here i've used and then the last thing that they got is this marula oil i've not gotten to use this because you can use it for your hair for your face because i already have like a face cream so i feel like i don't have use for this but this is how it looks like i love their packaging but it's so bougie absolutely love it so you open up like this Give me a minute <laughs> so yeah then you press here and then the oil comes out super super cute so yeah that's everything that seller essence sent me guys i'm going to leave their link on the description box like i said it's a skincare brand they have like a variety of things i'm going to link uh their page and uh yeah you can contact them and get something
so yeah guys that's everything that i got now i'm just waiting for my food but i'm having such a bad hair day i apologize i know it don't look nice and it's okay but let's focus on what's important for now which is doing my house making my house look nice so yeah i'm waiting for the fundi to come uh and fix your curtains and then we'll continue with the vlog later so for now let me uh have some lunch and then we'll catch up later the next day this woken up i want to catch up on some vlogs i'm still waiting for the guy to come and um hang my curtains imagine it didn't come yesterday so yeah i actually love her vlog so much her house is so aesthetic love her she's called noni i think i'll place her name on the screen you can check her out also i have decided to place the pampas grass on top of the console table i just need to get a vase honestly I was thinking of uh, using the ones that I have but they look really bad and because I am committed to the cause of having my house look as ma as aesthetic as possible I'm going to buy a new vase I don't know if if I go to town I will get one so yeah that's the current uh, state those are the curtains that the curtain rod that i was saying that i'm also going to change i don't know if i should hang it higher there's a comment that i saw recently and the lady was like if you hang the curtains zikwa higher they they look like they look better although i don't want the curtains to look short because they go all the way down there nazina fit perfectly so maybe i'll just retain that height so that the curtains zifika chini vizuri i don't want them to hang and have like a weird uh, space that is left but yeah the curtain rods i think they are gold in color so some to when you're in the room to a kuhang curtains like i don't understand why he's not coming and honestly i don't think this is work that i can do myself so we're just going to wait yeah and then to chelewesha but yeah so far so good i cannot wait to see how the curtains will look uh so yeah today today i know it will happen <laughs> guys please ignore how i'm looking right now but my fundi is here he is actually um removing the previous holders zile are cutting rods so i really can't wait to see how it all turns out i'm quite excited so yeah we'll see we'll see how it turns out cutting rods comes with these uh cutting holders cutting road holders i don't even know how they're called so this is perfect i actually thought when i was buying the cutting road I thought when I was buying the curtain rods, I would have to buy these ones separately. So in case you've never gotten curtain rods before, just know that when you buy them, you'll get these ones. So yeah. I've made us some um, breakfast, a very basic breakfast, just bread. I've toasted it by the way. I recently started toasting it and I feel like it tastes so good. And then some eggs obviously and a cup of tea. I haven't had tea that has milk in a while and i don't know even why by the way i just prefer majani but yeah that's my little breakfast let me take it and then yeah i'll show you the final result because so that's the first curtain road i've already changed it and i definitely underestimated how much work this would be imagine we've actually decided not to remove the holders for the curtain roads because e wall ni like so 
Ningumu Aitoboki, so the fundi has gone for the drill. So instead of even changing these curtain rods, like these holders to miamua to zika ivi, I've just placed the curtain rod up and I definitely feel like it looks so so much better. And sasa tukieka ile ingine to look great. So, so far, so good. Guys, my curtain is a bit longer, so I want to remove it and take it kwafundi. I just want to to be done with this business today. So nataka ipeleke kwafundi ifoldiwe because this is definitely not a good look. Um so yeah, let's do that. I'll show you the final look once everything is done. Guys, I actually the curtains are really growing on me. Yeah, they are. But anyway, they look good. They look good. Nisha peleka by the way kuchini. So that's how it looks like. I love it. I love it. Let's clean up because I have a lot of work to do today. My utensils are dirty. But yeah, let's clean up and then we see how like everything will look, yeah? Yeah. so we've restored order i really do wish that this carpet was bigger but it's okay let me show you this other side because that's the side that i am mostly in love with i love it so much yes i've still not um put the pampas grass but once i do i'll show you maybe I'm, i'll actually just push it and do it on this vlog because i don't think verses are like expensive and i want to get a textured one Maybe a white one, I don't know. Maybe in the end, um, uh, what's the name of this place? The one that is, yo, I've forgotten. Anyway, let me show you this other side. Bam! Oh my god, okay, okay, okay. Now it's growing on me. At first I didn't like it. <laughs> but now I think it looks really, really good. And this is a dining table, we go, I'm excited I'm excited so yeah so far so good I kind of wanted to show you how the house uh, is looking like at night 
I really love these curtains. You know what? They're actually looking good. At first I was like, hmm, I don't know. But now I feel like they're looking good. There's somebody who asked me whether the my curtains are like see-through. Totally they are. <laughs> In fact, I'm just from the shop and I could clearly see like inside my house. But I honestly don't mind because you can't clearly see, but you can see like um some shadows yeah so you can't like clearly clearly see someone but when you honor some shadows from the inside and then again uh the place where i live uh most of the land is empty like hakuna other houses like it's very it's quite impossible for someone to actually see me so yeah i wanted to answer that but if there were houses in Yezimejengwa Karibu na my house people could totally see um the inside but for now they can't which i'm okay with it so yeah i'm actually trying to catch up on a movie as i make my dinner but yeah oh my god i really love it especially from this side wow i know the quality doesn't look good but yeah so far so good totally love it guys so i've finally gotten the energy and the motivation to edit a vlog i actually felt like this vlog was not long enough i wanted to really post a long vlog maybe one hour but i've realized the way i'm procrastinating because the only thing that i've left uh was to buy a verse for my 
pampas grass i've still not gotten time to do that i've been saying oh i'll go tomorrow i'll go tomorrow because i really wanted to finish up with the vlog but then i was like no let me just edit whatever it is that i have and it's only because i've i've seen nairofi has posted because she's she's always motivating me and sometimes i usually ask myself like will will it ever get to a point where i'll be like getting as much views as she gets i know i'm being delusional but it's okay but then i do realize that in order for you to get those type of views that she usually gets then people have to enjoy your content guys i don't know if you know this the longer um people will watch your content the longer it will be recommended to other people and the more um views so basically what that means is that i really need to be posting like um interesting vlogs so what i've decided is that maybe by the day i'll only be posting when i have i genuinely have something um interesting to post <laughs> guys i'm sorry so this time round i don't think even consistency is even a factor because obviously you need to have something interesting happening so that people can watch your vlogs for longer so i have decided to concentrate on being um to give you guys quality vlogs more than quantity vlogs you know because sometimes i'll just be seated and i'll be like oh i've not posted for three days maybe let me let me let me think of what to to film and i feel like that is not good so i should be like leaning towards posting uh good content content that people will enjoy so if you're a youtuber and you're watching this by the way try it my way and tell me if it works and i'm also also i'm also experimenting guys it's not like <laughs> maybe maybe it will not work maybe it will work but oh so, yeah guys that's what i have decided actually let me try and edit with you munipe company and comment down below tell me what you have been up to but i think this is the end of the vlog because this is the vlog that i'm i'm i'm, I'm trying to edit so hopefully you you guys are going to watch it tomorrow hopefully so yeah let's edit together comment down below tell me what you've been up to been a few hours, but it felt like days Only been days, but it felt like months I've been gone for a year, only know like once Life moves fast when you do what you want I guess I'm doing what I want Hope you know what you want I don't know if I've recently showed you my collection of plants. Um, the other plant that I had completely died. I had to report some of these, especially this one. This one that has a black and white um, vase. But I just wanted to show you because I feel like they're looking great. This one is really growing. I've just removed them out here so that they can get some sun. But so far, so good. So I replanted this one and this other, these two actually, this one and this one. But yeah, they look so cute. I need to get a taller plant, but yeah, I just wanted to show you the progress. I totally love them. These are house plants, by the way. So I love how they are growing so far. So yeah.